a very low amount. So if you get your water heater replaced, stick it outside your house, run it in, you know. And now you're refreshing, you know, you don't have to worry about dealing with the water in the barrel. You're refreshing that water every time you turn your taps on. And use it. So you could have a hundred of them. You could have a thousand gallons. Exactly. And then run it back into your house and as you're using your water. And they won't freeze like the whole house filter. These are insulated, you can paint them up, make them look prettier. Basically, my plan is to cover these with what I call cowboy wood, is wood from old cabins and things that you can find or pallets even, and you just kind of just screw it onto the cage. Um, these are also food grade. Um, I buy these from down below too. These are 135 and they're 275 gallons each. This is what I use for uh, water depth. Uh, two of these together is 550 gallons. They're 135 and um, if you want them delivered I charge $10 for each frame. Um, that's just because gas is good. But they will fit into you know, a small pickup easily. You can tie them down really good. They're not terribly heavy. They're palletized, they can be stacked pretty high. They, they bring over orange juice, mango, you know, stuff like that in them. And they can't send them back, they can only use them once. So these are readily available on the center. You can get a lot of them like at Cowboy Trail, but they have paint in them and stuff like that. These are all food grade that I buy. I don't get anything else and they've been washed out by a pressure hot washer at the guy's plant that recirculates them. And this is what I use and I prefer to use. Um, it's, a lot, it's about half of what a Bushman system will cost you. Um, it's stackable, it goes up higher. Every foot you raise up above ground will create four pounds of pressure. And because they're wide, that amplifies as you get bigger around too. That's why your water tanks are so large, is to help create pressure. They pump the water out of the ground. It doesn't come to your house, it goes up into the tanks on the hills. And that creates head pressure, which creates a pressure that runs into your house. In uh, places that are flat, you have to put towers way up high. For the same reason, they pump the water up there, fill the tower, and create the pressure to run the whole city. So, basically, what we're going to learn today is these are spa fittings and PVC fittings. I tie these two together. I just created it by head pressure, and I just run my gutter right into the top of my tank. Um, we do have